More than a year ago, Sean Knowles' home went up in flames. The family lost their cats and their house. Investigators say the fire started with a lithium ion battery inside a vacuum. And it's not just homes. Across the country, battery fires have destroyed apartments, shut down highways, filled airplane cabins, even local schools with smoke. Firefighters say these batteries burn hotter, release toxic gases, and can reignite hours or even days later. At Tarrant County College, crews set a car on fire for us to test new tactics. A turtle nozzle that blasts water into the battery. And a heavy fire blanket that smothers the flames. There's not a lot of data out there on what the best option is to put out these EV fires. Globally, there have been nearly 17,400 lithium ion battery incidents since 1995, with more than 4,500 injuries and almost 700 reported deaths. Never took, took a second thought, leave something plugged in. Now I do, and now I hope the next person will too after they hear the story.